Good afternoon, hello, welcome to the Triathlon Down YouTube channel. Another day of triathlon training, lunchtime run time with Mark. Good afternoon, Mark. Good afternoon, everyone. You okay? Very well, thank you. Yeah. Good. Mark and I do this thing, like mid-morning in the office, we're like, are you running today? Are you running today? And the other person who is, isn't the person that's asked will always say, what is it we say? I've got kit. I've got kit, but I'm not quite sure. Yeah. Then we're like, oh, okay, shall we, shall we? And it always ends up with us running. Yeah. So I don't know why we go through that rigmarole, but it's fun. <laughs> anyway, today's run is going to be some tempo efforts. I thought I'd talk a little bit about the benefits of tempo running. So for me, focusing on 70.3 triathlons, so middle distance, the run is a half marathon. That is pretty much a tempo effort. So therefore running at tempo is really race specific for me. You get that bit more efficient working at that tempo zone. <clears throat> it's pretty low injury risk because you're not running flat out and stretching on loads your stride length and it's not actually that hard so you can do it when you're fatigued or in a training week now today i'm going to be doing four times three minutes tempo off of one and a half minutes recovery and i think my tempo is going to be seven and a bit minute mining but i'm going to see how i feel i haven't done tempo for ages so i'm going to play it by ear within reason with a view to over the next few weeks building it up to like longer tempo blocks it might be like a 15 minute tempo block in the middle but you've got to start somewhere i think i've got like nine weeks until my first middle distance try so plenty of time to get into good run shape are you a fan of tempo running mark love it you do big blocks don't you ah, so, yeah it's good fun yeah i like tempo good effort keeps the heart rate honest uh -huh. and good for all round fitness yeah i see you go out and do stuff like five miles of tempo because yeah. you know what that pace is. Yeah, it's a five mile effort, three mile effort. Yeah. Um, when I decided I was going to train for a marathon, yeah. I did do some blocks of 45 minutes to an hour. Uh -huh. um, but then I got injured and didn't do the marathon. <laughs> so, cool. But yeah, <laughs> always good to have tempo efforts in the training block. Cool. Right, let's get running. done and dusted i'll leave the stats on screen mark just about hung on didn't you mark just about oh. he doesn't even notice when i'm doing tempo to be honest so four times three minutes as planned went well the first two i think were about seven and a half minute mile in they're a bit up and down the first two efforts weren't they in terms of terrain so if anything the second one was quite easy because it was slightly downhill but then the second two three minute blocks are both on the pan flat and we're both just about spot on seven minute mile in that felt good it wasn't hard it's probably a little bit faster than what my tempo is if i'm Comparing it to running 70.3 runs, it's about 20 seconds a mile faster. I think I ran about 7.20 is my best 7.3 last year. So that felt good. As the blocks lengthen over the next few weeks, that pace might you know, become a little bit slower, but I felt like a good workout. I'm really happy that I've touched wood, I've not got any aches or pains or anything. So yeah, feeling good. Is that a good workout for you then, Mark? Loved it. Thank you very much for sorting that <laughs> out for me. But, gen <laughs> but genuinely, doing these sorts of intervals with somebody else is a, is a big help. So yeah, yeah, anyway. Yeah, the lunch runs easier. It is. See you tonight for a bike session. Not you. <laughs> okay, so it's evening bike session time. I thought I was doing a tempo workout tonight and I was going to continue this conversation about training at tempo intensity. However, it's unfortunately a little bit harder. It is four times six minutes threshold off of four minutes recovery. So that will be a nice little workout for me to crack on with now. I'm glad now the video about my gravel bike will have gone out, so I don't need to keep hiding this thing behind me. Well done, Chief, you spotted it over the last few weeks in videos. I've not done a great job of hiding it, but the majority of people didn't see it or the big canyon box behind it in the background. Anyway, I'm gonna get on the bike and get this session done, come on. Oh, good session that. Let's look at the splits. I don't use erg mode, I just use gears, but I think I've got erg mode built into my legs. First six minutes was 351 watts, the second one 352, 
The third one, 350, and the fourth one, 354. That wasn't easy, but it felt like a controlled level of hard, as I suppose threshold should do. So really encouraging for me after a couple of weeks of poor training, illness, etc. To be able to get back into it now is good. Just need a few weeks of consistency, and I will be happy chappy. Let's go and see what Elizabeth is doing, though, because she walked past this door earlier in cycling kit. Turn that music down before I get copyrighted. Da 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 Dawn and Cherie, big up! Big up Dawn and Cherie! <laughs> Don't work, girls. Now tonight, Liz, I thought tonight was running club night. We didn't go because it was snowing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it was snowing, wasn't it? Have you got, have you got banding on? Yeah. Well, I hate to break it to you, but it doesn't matter how hard you go up a hill. Well, I still won, that's what <laughs> If you're watching this Dawn and Cherie, Liz says she's won. Yeah. Right, anyway, good ride. God, you've run nearly an hour. Hello. Good work. I'll give you a high five for that. Have you been going steady other than that? Have you been doing the intervals or what? We're going uphill. <laughs> How can I have an interval when I've been going uphill for the last 50 minutes? 50 minutes? Pretty oh, you've got the epic KOM. Yeah. Oh, that's a big hill. <laughs> Liz, language, family channel. Anyway. I just need to tell these well done big up girls. <laughs> Good work. Okay, I think on that note, I'm going to end today's video there. Good to see you on the bike, Liz. I will come and join you. Oh, look at the times. I've got one second quicker than dawn. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mm. We were racing. <laughs> do, they know, do they know you were racing or was no. it just a private thing? <laughs> really? You've got a heart rate monitor on. I am going to estimate 200 beats a minute. Uh, no, don't get that high on the bike. No. Okay, that's it for today's video then. Thank you very much for watching. I hope your training is going well. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you tomorrow for some more proper triathlon training. Come on! <laughs>